beautiful lake though, but the campground itself is packed. Yeah. I mean, it looks like a it's commercial site. The gills. It's, it's, yeah. it's just trailers and trucks within three feet of each other. And so. it doesn't look like there's any designated spots either. It's just people crowding together. No, I'm sure there is. Yeah. Okay, we'll carry on. on the Steelhead Provincial Park campground so we're heading over to Tunkwa Provincial Park off Highway 1 on Tunkwa Lake Road which we are on right now and it's paved for 30 kilometers and we're going about 25 kilometers in from Highway 1. Beautiful country, very different from earlier on when we were driving through desert. check out the other two uh, camping areas in this park. There's the, the Layton and the North Layton campground. because it looks like um, it's the same spot as the ATV staging area and uh, we can actually see the campground from here. There's a bunch of RVs over there so it might be a little noisy for us. But we're still trying to decide if we're gonna stay here at Leighton campground or go back to Tunkwa Lake. Bumpy marshy around here. Okay yeah we're going back to Tunkwa campground because I mean, Leighton was perfectly fine, and they had nice views of the lake. There was a nice site, but there was a big group, so we're just worried about it being really noisy tonight. We were worried that they're partiers. So back to Tunkwa Lake campground. Yeah, I think this is our spot. Fairly busy because of the Canada Day long weekend, but we've got this spot which we think is actually pretty good. Trees between us and the next RV. So far, nobody behind us. Nice. Lots of Canada flags. We'll put ours up in a minute. And there's a lake here, fairly big, mostly just canoes and electric motors. And then you can't see it, but there's another lake here that goes around over there. So we've got two different lakes that we can. Paddle on. Looking forward to that. You have a little water droplet on your chin. Yep. We sprinkled some fresh turkey on her food. Precious, for the most part, gets a special diet. She gets a diet especially for 
her thyroid. Something on your bun. Oh. <laughs> Oops. Oops. Oh. Let me get that off. Oh, let me get that off. Oh. You're drinking a lot of water. Found a little waterfall. Well, basically, this lake's probably about 30 feet higher, 10 meters higher than this lake, so there's a little creek running from both of them. on those rocks. leads to a bluff, which presumably is over there. Bluff Lakes just through there. Don't know if you'll be able to see it with the camera, but we'll try and cut through on another trail. Beautiful. Lots of people out fishing. Mm -hmm. Bluff Lake. Tofu. I've got salmon. Going for a paddle on Tonkwa Lake. Just setting up the alpaca pack raft. And there's some wicked storm clouds over there, so we're hoping they're not coming this way. Boat wake! <laughs> Just passed right in front of us. Gordon wouldn't slow down.
bluff we were on earlier. From the other side. Ducks will be complaining that we're disturbing their peace. <laughs> Sorry, Ducky. Didn't mean to scare ya. That's the end there. against the wind. Hey, rough bees. The wind's really picking up. <laughs> it's like a amusement park ride. <laughs> Some rocks down here, sweetie. Oh, oh it? uh, it's pretty shallow. Oh, oh, oh shoot! Let's get up away from the island. God, look at all the bugs with me. Yeah, I told you to be a bug Yeah, it's like central. After paddle beer. I was still trying to finish that six pack of Happy Camp. <laughs> we don't drink a lot. Last couple drinks. I usually, I usually drink about 20 to 30 percent, and then Mickey has the rest, and that's it for the week. Yep. Cheers, good Cheers. paddle. Good paddle. The happy campers everywhere. Ooh, I think we'll get a nice sunset. Yeah, we're just noting there's uh, virtually no wind at all and the lake looks like glass. Mm -hmm. Of course, it was getting a little windy when we came mm -hmm. back, not bad, but yeah. now it's just smooth, it looks really nice. I was a little wet because I had a shower outside tonight. Canada Day! Good morning everyone! We're just leaving Tunkwa Lake Provincial Park. Which we really enjoyed. Um, it's a Canada Day long weekend so you'd expect a lot of people to be out and there were. What's neat about that park is no reservations. Um, you'll see in some of the video where large groups of people have got together, primarily close to the lake. But if you're any farther back, there's lots of big open spots. As Mickey said this morning, it's kind of like camping on a farm. We, we really enjoyed it. 
Nice paddle. We just did uh, Tunkwa Lake. We didn't do the adjacent lake. Um, but yeah, just great. Uh, it's not a place for swimming. Oh, you know, for me anyway, I'd like to go back. I really enjoyed it. So we're just taking an alternate route back. We're going to be going through Logan Lake to Merritt. And Tunkwa Lake Road is, we thought that it was only paved up to like 30 kilometers, but it looks like it is paved. Uh, Gordon was talking to some people this morning who told him that it was paved. Uh, but there are some wicked potholes, uh, more on the opposite direction. So we're just going to be really careful when we're driving along this road, but it's a much shorter way to Merritt, and then we'll be on the Coquihalla after that, and hopefully stop by for veget samosas. <laughs> vegetarian samosas. So one thing on this trip we did miss was our uh, camera with our zoom lens. Um, it's been in for repairs with Sony now for I guess a couple of weeks or soon to be two weeks. Yeah. So unfortunately there is some beautiful shots we would love to have had a chance to get a little closer in on. And hopefully in the next few weeks we'll be able to do that once again. Both up we wanna leave behind. So that's really quirky. On every fence post there is a ball cap. <laughs> yeah, kind of cool. I have a lot yeah. of ball caps at home next time we're here. Yeah, and it just keeps going on and on and on. It, it's still going. Oh my gosh. Going on forever. I mean, we're probably at a kilometer of ball caps. We got the end of it. <laughs> I'm tempted to stop and put this campfire, but... <laughs> no, you like that whole cat. Some more world famous samosas at the Britton Creek Rest Stop on the Coquihalla Highway. Thanks everyone for watching our video. And if you enjoyed the video, please give us a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Till next time.